Awesome. Hey, aloha everybody. Uh, I'm Dennis Matheson and I'm in my studio here in Honolulu, Hawaii and I'm really, really excited about releasing a brand new painting that I just finished. I don't even have a title for this piece yet, but all I can tell you is it's taken my metal art to a whole nother level. I mean that as a pun, of course, because there's so many levels to this piece of art. This piece of 5052 marine grade aluminum has 33 pieces total to it. In other words, it's 33 little paintings all put together into one piece of art. It's awesome. It's got, uh, it came from like this uh, eight foot uh, by uh, uh, a four foot piece of aluminum and all the pieces were cut from it. Uh, multiple pieces that all had to be sanded and, and, and ground down on the edges and treated and, and grinding and painting and oh my gosh, it just kind of overwhelms me to think about it. It took months to produce this piece of art. But the idea came about a year ago and I've been really wanting to try some other levels to my art. Keeping my art alive and you know doing so many metal originals in my time, like almost 22, 2300 uh, metal, aluminum, or copper or brass or stainless paintings, I'm always trying to come up with a new idea to keep my passion really blossoming onto other subjects. So, I'm uh, known for my waves, of course. I mean, if you've been into uh, any of the galleries here in Hawaii, you've seen my metal waves for, for a couple decades now. I mean, I started doing these ground metal aluminum waves probably about 15 years ago or more, and they've become quite a signature style of mine. And, uh, but taking those waves into another idea I thought would be unique. The possibilities are endless with this whole technique. But for here I did the waves. I added, actually added all these dimensional pieces. Each piece was treated as one painting. Ground, process, put together. Then I had to map it all out. I came up with all these different techniques and trials and, and a few uh, errors and a few mishaps. But that's the whole beauty of art is at the end result you got this really killer piece of art. I think it's really going to be awesome that I'm going to be able to take this with me to the Bill Weiland Gallery 
for next week's second year uh, anniversary, you know, party. We're having, I mean, we have a show, I guess you call it, but to me, it's a party. I get to actually have this piece there with me. So, two years of our great success there on Front Street, and now I got a whole new level of art. So, I'm thinking maybe some uh, bamboo, maybe some other ideas, some other, maybe a bird of paradise would be killer and maybe even some my tiki or marine art stuff at other levels. So I'm getting my creative juices going again. So stay tuned. But in the meantime, join me if you're on Maui and you're in Lahaina. I'll be there uh, July 13th and 14th for our anniversary show along with all my other killer artist friends that are part of Bill Wilden Gallery. And uh, we're having to have a big party that night. So come by, check it out. You never know who's going to show up. Lots of rock stars over there in Lahaina, and uh, they're known to browse through. So uh, come see us, have some fun, and uh, look forward to seeing you. Say hi if you're there. In the meantime, I'm going to say aloha here from my overpacked, overwhelmed studio here in Honolulu. I got no room, but once these paintings get out into Lahaina, it's going to be awesome. Stay tuned. Aloha.